So these Arrow 23 mirrors finally showed up. And this is what's in the box. From what I understand, these are Ganador molds. I don't know if they ever made R33 sedan Ganadors. But Aero 23 is making them. Fit and finish looks good at first glance. These are the lenses. They send you some tape, some foam tape. They also send you these instructions with uh, wiring pinouts, which is helpful as they are power mirrors. And then you also get the, I guess you get blue and regular mirror finish. I'm definitely gonna go blue. Okay, so to get the mirrors off, you unfortunately have to pull off the whole door panel. Uh, you start off by pulling off this little plastic trim around the handle. And there's gonna be two screws on the bottom and three screws on the upper half of the door panel. One's behind the door handle trim. One is below the window switch and then one's underneath the armrest right here then the door panel is held in just by snaps and pulls up there's a little shelf on the top that the door panel slots into there's going to be a harness plug for the window switch and this is how it looks like on the back and then two screws to take off the mirror the mirror cover Undo the harness, there's going to be three bolts to hold on the mirror. Arrow 23 says to be careful with the over tightening the, the mirrors because they're fiberglass, it might break. And there's double sided tape to hold on the lens. On the OEM harness, uh, I took it apart and started depinning de -pinning it using a pick. There's really no point to this because this car will probably never get stock mirrors again. But I, I felt bad cutting this harness. Now wiring wise, you're going to do on chassis side the yellow blue wire is going to be used for the up and down function of the mirror. And it's going to go to the green wire on the Ganador. The blue red chassis side wire is going to go to the, to the white wire on the Ganador and it's used for left and right function. And then the purple and white wire on the chassis goes to the gray wire and is used as a ground by the mirror motor. And then reinstallation of the door panel is the same thing in reverse. The three bolts behind the window switch, the grab handle, and that little pull. Now just to make sure that the, win the mirror functions, it looks all good. And I thought the car also looked good with the Series 2 taillights, so I just wanted to <laughs> show that video. I also got bucket seat mounts from Nagisa Auto. I don't really know if these are the lowest mounts or if it's just the chassis that doesn't let you go really low. It seems like there's a lot of room, but that's as low as it goes. And it seems high to me because I'm used to the 240s that are super low and also raked a little bit. This one's very flat, but should be okay. Anything's better than nothing. I hope this video was informative because there was absolutely negative information about how to wire up the Ganators. If you have any questions, comment. Uh, and I also have the wiring pinout in the description.